one of India's top priorities in this decade is becoming a global hub for semiconductors. They play a crucial role in powering diverse sectors from electronics to cars to military weapons, and their significance grew multifold, especially during the pandemic, which impacted global supply chains. The Modi government is keen that India emerges as a trusted partner for the semiconductor industry and wants India to be a chip maker and supplier for the world. Today, India has moved a big step forward towards that goal. Prime Minister Modi has laid the foundation stone for three crucial semiconductor facilities in India worth nearly 1.25 lakh crore rupees. One in Dolera in Gujarat, one in Sanand in Gujarat and one in Assam. The government wants Dolera to be the future home of India's first semi-corn city. The new industrial city being developed is bigger than the size of Singapore. Two of the three plants is being set up by the Tata Group, the first one of which is in Dolera. A total of over 91,000 crore rupees is being invested for this. This is India's first commercial semiconductor fabrication plant, a long-standing ambition of New Delhi. It's being done by the Tata Group and Taiwan's PSMC. And India's first ever semiconductor chip which will come from this plant will be ready to roll out by the end of 2026. This will be the beginning of India's actual acceleration in the manufacturing and chip space. According to PSMC, since semiconductors are an expensive business, it takes more effort to set up the first fab. Once that's done, it's easier to set up more. The central and state governments are together subsidizing about 70% of the project cost as per estimates. PSMC will provide Tata with the fab. The plant will first start manufacturing 28 nanometer chips which will cater to India's supply chain needs and in the future will start making 22 nanometer chips which are more high end. PSMC will train Indian engineers in Taiwan on fabs and help with technology transfer. While several companies wanted to get this support for tech transfer, Accelerating the timeline, typically a fab takes four years. Our goal is to produce the chip in calendar year 26, hopefully in the later, in the later part of the year, but it will be in the calendar year 26. So we have got a very aggressive timeline. PSMC decided on Tata since they felt it's the best choice due to its financing, prestige and the size of the company. This fab facility in Dolora will have a manufacturing capacity of up to 50,000 wafers per month. Besides high-performance compute chips, it will make power management chips for EVs, chips for telecom, defense, electronics and others. Besides this plant, Tata and Test Private Limited are setting up a chip assembly and testing unit in Assam. These chips will be made with Made in India technology and be used for automobiles. CG Power and Japanese firm Renesas will be setting up a plant in Sanand in Gujarat which will be able to produce 15 million chips per day. हमने दो साल पहले सेमीकंडक्टर मिशन शुरू करते हुए इनिशिएटिव्स लेने की घोषणा की इसके कुछ ही महीनों में हमारे पहले एमओ साइन हो गए और आज सिर्फ कुछ महीनों के भीतर हम तीन प्रदेश का शिलान्यास कर रहे हैं India commits, India delivers, and democracy delivers. आने वाले समय में हम semiconductor sector से जुड़े products का commercial production करेंगे। वो दिन दूर नहीं। जब भारत इसमें भी एक ग्लोबल पावर बनेगा